It's Misha Connie O'Connell, us Kilnamatra. When I was young, there would be house dances and people would be gathering in special occasions, such as trashings and stations and things like that. They'd have a dance in the house by night. That was my first introduction to traditional music. Well, there was the slides and polkas, which is common around this area. You're in the very southern tip of Shlieb Lokri here. Well, you'd have hornpipes and jigs as well, of course, part of the set. I was about 12 years, I think, when I got my first fiddle. I went into McCroom then when I was about maybe 15, 16, 17 years. There was a man inside that taught me how to read music. The tunes were in my head, so then you bring them out in the fiddle then, you know, and I worked from there. I didn't start writing anything until mid-80s, I think. The idea of the book, Body and Smita, I had all these tunes written down in little bits of paper all over the place. And I got the idea that it would be good to put them together, to put it online and make it available to the world, which is what happened. There's 69 tunes in the book, a mixture of all sorts, reels, jigs, hornpipes, slides, polkas, kind of a mixture of the whole lot. Temple, Media Gokta Donu Gokta, Three Kusk, Egober, Agor, Mihalo Sulwan, a UCC. And I think it's important to teach Irish traditional music to students that attend the college and to give them some insight into what it's about. Anya's living in West Limerick and she has three kids and they're all playing. Nisha, Elin and Evna. And I teach Elin the fiddle. She's very promising, she's a very good fiddle player. So I'm teaching her online because she's too far away otherwise, so we do a session once a week. That's what we want really, is to spread our music as much as possible. We're supposed to pass it on to the next generation or generations to come.